Welcome back, awesome Astro fans and subscribers. I'm looking at a Marvel Universe set in humans. This set is quite old. It is from 2012, so seven years old. I found this in a Toys R Us in Malaysia the other day for 105 ringgit, dirt cheap. So I'm really happy with this because this is actually quite a rare set and the prices can range quite a lot in uh, on eBay and online. So we have Black Bolt, Karnak and Medusa. It says, Although Black Bolt sits suddenly on the throne of Attilian, he is hardly voiceless. His queen speaks his will and enforces it with the powerful tangles of her prehensile hair. Meanwhile, Karnak uses his uncanny ability to spot any weakness to advise the king and his incredible fighting skills to defend the royal family. When all else fails and Black Bolt must speak, his voice cracks the power of an atomic bomb. Great looking set. I'm really looking forward to Medusa. The other two, not so much. Okay, let's crack this open and good. And have a look. More tape, foiled. Okay, there we go. Okay, let's look at Karnak first of all. They've given a really big head there. Must be because of his uh, mental capacity, his brains. Let's stand him up and have a look. Sculpt is quite cool. The extra big forehead is a bit unusual perhaps, but it has uses. Um, he can look left and right. Uh, there is a small up and down and there's no side to side. Shoulders go nice and high, I can see. Lovely, look at that. Or nice and high on one side, maybe and not the other. Okay, there we go. And on his arm band, he gets over 90 degrees, just about, which is nice. Waist, he has the trunk, but no separate waist. Hip joints, yeah, these hips I can't stand. Doesn't go very far. He does have a thigh swivel, and forwards is okay, backwards is terrible. Double kneecap, and with his thin legs, he'll get quite a tight uh, bend. And the foot, there is side to side, up and down but no uh, rock either way. He does look nice. Okay. And he has the uh, bicep swivel as well, which is a nice uh, feature to have on your action figures. Okay, let's put him over, over here. And he is quite easy to stand up. Let's look at Black Bolt. Oh, and Connex gone down. Okay, Black Bolt. Standard looking Marvel figure, these little wing things attached to him here. Um, and he's got a really bent leg as well. If you look at his right leg here, look at that banana bend there. Uh, that'll be from probably the uh, peg that goes inside. But that can be straightened out, that's not too difficult to fix. He looks all right. Um, not really my cup of tea. These little things, his arms can be taken off. It looks, they just look a bit silly. Um, his arms go quite high up. His bicep curl is okay. He has a open hand and closed hands, and Karnak is the same fist, but his open hand is different on Karnak. He gets his left and right up and down and a eh, tiny side to side. He has the trunk, 
he has the waist which is extra hips aren't great fours are backwards mm, so it's all right thigh swivel double kneecap nice and tight he has the lower leg swivel which Karnak doesn't have and his feet do go side to side yay and up and down but the turn is from the leg not the foot yeah it's not a bad thing to be fair it just feels a bit rubbery in terms of the uh, plastic used on him which is a bit of a shame so does Karnak a little bit okay to get his arms down again And a little bit difficult to stand up, a little bit difficult. Okay, stand him up and we'll look him next to Karnak. Karnak with the uh, extra big dome head is a little bit taller. Okay, let's look at the one that I'm really looking forward to, Medusa, for this fabulous hair they've given her. Okay, it's a lot easier to pop the head off. Now this weighs a lot, which means she's going to fall backwards. Fortunately, because the hair is so long, it will counterbalance and act as a third contact point. So she'll be quite easily to quite easy to stand her up like that. She does look amazing. I mean, that hair is superb. It's rubbery, so it's got some flex to it. It's not this hard, hard plastic hair. She looks so good. Obviously, it's going to really affect her articulation, like looking left a little bit, looking right a little bit, looking down. No, because it just bong, straighten out. Looking up, she can't. Side to side, she can't. Uh, it will get in the way maybe of her shoulders. Let's have a look. Uh, no, she's okay on the shoulders. Hair doesn't get in the way. She has hands that are mirror image, where they're like this. This is over here. It's almost like a Spider Man there. Um, bicep curl, she gets about 90 degrees, is okay. She does have the trunk for twisting. Little falls are backwards. They've done a Great job on the chest breast area there. Um, there's no waist twist. Hips aren't great. Does have the thigh twist. Double kneecap, but with the hair getting in the way, it's not going to make much difference. She gets quite tight there. Or maybe the hair will still balance. Let's have a look. Yeah. There we go. Um, on the feet, she has the... Uh, leg turn and she has um, up and down but there is oh and it is the swivel here but no foot turn she is a really really nice looking figure and she is tall with the hair okay how do these compare to some other figures uh, let me use Zoe from Zombie Labs, and I love this figure so much. They are taller than Zoe, and Zoe is quite a large 118 figure. Uh, let me use. Let me see. Let me use my favourite Marvel Infinite Hulk, who is a huge beast, and he towers above them. Oops! Oh, sorry, Black Bolt. But they do scale well. These are actually quite large, larger than I thought I thought they would be. And a 
DC Multiverse Mr. Freeze, who is a big figure, and he's slightly taller than all of them. These are great, great figures. Hard to find, sought after. You can, well, hard to find, normally they're expensive if you find them. I was quite lucky to find it in the shop for, you know, for original retail price, which is really quite cool. Uh, worth getting just for Medusa, though you could use Black Bolt and Kar Karnak for customs if you don't want them that way, or not Marvel fans, or you're not Inhumans fans. Okay, this is All Smash Toys signing out, and I am saying please like, share, and subscribe. I'll be back to the more All Smash Toys videos for you. Stay happy, keep collecting, and please click on the notifications icon to always stay up to date with the latest content, okay? Bye-bye.